Hey everyone, today I'm going to be doing a summer haul for you all. I have a few places, Target, Urban Outfitters, and Loft. I know, kind of. I'm hitting every point of the spectrum, basically, but I want to go ahead and get started. So, I have two separate trips to Urban Outfitters that I'm going to talk about. I made an online order, first of all. And they had some sort of sale, I think. It was 30% off select items, and they were items that I had already wanted, so, or had my eye on. The first one is going to be the top that I was wearing in my last video, my Project Use It Up video. But it is navy and white striped stripes, and it is one of the halter tie-ups. And this is the Project Social Tea and Urban Outfitters brand. And I got all of this stuff in an extra small, just so you know, the Urban Outfitters stuff. But yeah, it's a little cropped, it looks small, it's hard to see, but I'm going to be showing, I'm gonna be trying all these things on. So I got that one, and I also got it in the black version. This has a thinner tie, so they're kind of different, but as you will see in the try-on portion, I found, I think, three ways to tie the ties. So you can either wear it like this and tie it up as you normally would and let the ties kind of dangle. You can also tie it just around your neck, so pull it up so that those ties aren't in the way and just tie it behind your neck. Or you can kind of loop it around your neck and have it come across right here to have a little bit more of like a grungy, sexy sort of look and tie it like that. So those are the ways that I found that you might not think of on your own. Then this is from the brand Truly Madly Deeply. It is like the teeniest little crop top ever, but it is just a nice soft light gray. Again, nice with like high-waisted shorts or really anything. Just really comfy. So those are the things that I ordered online. And then these next few things are items that I got in store. If I can find the other one. They were having a sale and then their sale was an extra 30% off. So I got a dress, but I got these two tops. These are the, I think this is a Project Social Tee as well. These are the... Uh, lace up but they're the T version or the tank version sorry so they're not a halter this is the wine color which is really pretty and then the color that I'm also wearing um, right now it's a kind of blush nude really pretty I love these these look really great tucked into high-waisted jeans so I love that and then I've been on the hunt for new summer dresses just something really comfy and casual to wear. So this is from the BDG brand and it was originally $49 marked down to $29.99 and then 30% off. So I got it for I think $21. So that's, I mean, compared to the $50 original, I think that's pretty great. And it's super comfy, super stretchy. So it is just a basic, basically a t-shirt dress-ish type of thing. It has that lettuce edge like they say. I hope you can see it. It's like kind of ruffled and it has a little pocket. Just super simple but I think it's casual yet sexy at the same time. I love it. Okay, um, I guess I'll continue with dresses. So I got these two from Target because they were on sale. So these are current styles that you can get now. But the first one is the Exhilaration brand. Again, I got both of these in an extra small. Target dresses are small enough that they actually fit me. I know everyone doesn't have that problem, but I'm super petite. I have a small waist and Target stuff is small enough that it actually fits. Not that that matters for these style of dresses because they are more flowy, but just wanted to mention that if you're really small and petite, Target is great for that. So I got this one, which is a cream and black stripe, just like an A-line flowy dress with the black kind of crocheted neck piece. I think that's really cute. And then also this one, this is the Mossimo brand. I just have it on a hanger because I got these a little while ago. 
but it is just a black kind of crinkly dress. I don't know if you'll be able to tell by the material. Yeah, you can see it. It's that purposefully crinkly material, which I like because you don't have to worry about it like looking crinkly, but not on purpose, you know? But it is just a tank, and then it has the cold shoulder, which I really like. It has sort of like a rounded v-neck, and it has pockets, which is amazing, and it's a nice length. So, really love those. If you couldn't tell, I love black black dresses. I think they're super flattering, super cute. And then I also got three of their, I believe they're the Boyfriend T v-neck, the Mossimo brand. So, I just really love these. They're soft. They were cheap. They were on sale. I got them in two separate trips as well, and they were on sale both times. But I got this really pretty, it's kind of a mix between a lavender and a lilac. It has a little bit more pink than a lavender, but not that much. But anyway, got that one. Got this green and then kind of like a muted light blue. And then from Loft, I went in because they were having a sale. Their sale is the really the only way that I ever buy stuff because you can always get 60% off of their sale items, which makes them so affordable. And yeah, so I ended up getting these two tops. They were each $14. I couldn't believe it. These were, I went to South Park Mall if you're in the Charlotte area. South Park Mall has the best loft store. Like the one that's near me does not have a big petite section and the sale section is always, I mean it's a decent size, but it was nowhere near as big as this one. So I was able to score a lot of things and actually in my size, because that's the problem. They never have my size in the store because I'm the smallest size that they make. It's the extra, extra small petite. So anyway, but I got three tops. This one is a cream. You guys know if you've watched any of my hauls that I am obsessed with cream recently but it just looks like that it has ties like little tassels just really simple it is a oh gosh what do they call it mixed media the front is that nice polyester blouse material but the back is a more slouchy comfy material and I got the same exact top in this red color which I would normally never get but it was pretty, and like I said, it was only 14 bucks, so I thought, you know, there's no harm in that. And I think this would really look good with, like, khaki-colored pants, which I need to get because I don't have any, and I think that is the one thing that my wardrobe is missing. Maybe that and some gray, nice, like, business casual pants. And then I got this top. This was $18, and it's just a more sheer navy blouse. Again, has a little ties I wouldn't do anything with they look good undone but yeah just something really simple again this would look good with you could do navy on navy with navy pants or khaki so yeah that is all of the stuff that I have purchased recently clothing wise I I think I'm pretty good on my shopping for this year or this summer at least, because I wanted some things that were more like the stuff that I got from Urban Outfitters, a little bit more edgy, but also some nicer things, and just super casual things as well, like the tees. So, yeah, that's it. Let me know if you have purchased anything recently, what your favorite stores are to shop at, and yeah, that's about it. I hope you all are having a fantastic day. Thank you so, so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, everyone.